On November 7, 2023, OpenAI introduced an exciting new capability called Assistance that allows you to build powerful custom assistants very easily. We're going to take a closer look at this and build out an example to showcase what it can do. There are four major capabilities that they offer. The first one, different models, including ones that can interpret images, or as OpenAI would put it, models that can see. Second is that it can use tools that you can build, such as custom tools to retrieve financial information, or also ability to uh, build tools that retrieve knowledge from custom data sources or chat with your data type of applications. A third one is to be able to access persistent threads by storing message history and helping to automatically manage the storage. So more ability to access the history of chats automatically. And the last one here is that assistants can create files in different formats like images and spreadsheets and the like. In our use case, we're going to build an assistant called Sam, who is skilled at analyzing quarterly reports. We're going to deep dive specifically into a shipping company, FLMG, and their third quarter results. So let's get started. I'm going to start on my FlowWise home screen and go to the assistance uh, tab. There's a new tab here, and I'm going to add my new assistant. I'm going to call this assistant Sam, and what he does is stock analysis, and I'm going to give it a new GPT-4. Uh, this is the one with a large context window, so I'll select this. I will then select my credentials, and I'm going to give it some instructions. Analyzing stock reports. Okay, All right, I'm going to add this in. All right, I'm going to have now a OpenAI assistant called Sam, and then I'm going to go into uh, my OpenAI uh, account, and inside here there is going to be an assistance uh, tab as well. So I'll just refresh this and Flowwise has created this assistant for me and I can just go ahead and select this. And inside here, it's already pre-populated some of the information that I need. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upload a file. So this file here will be uh, the FLNG uh, third quarter presentation, okay? So this presentation, uh, basically contains the third quarter reports and it's going to upload this now and then it's going to uh, allow me to uh, chat with this PDF. So I'll save this. All right, so now my assistant is uh, skilled now with this custom knowledge base. I'm gonna go back to my Flowwise uh, window. I'm gonna create a new chat flow. I'm gonna add new and I'm going to create a new agent, and in this agent, I'm going to select the OpenAI assistant, and then I'm going to select Sam, the one that I just created, okay? So I'll save this, Sam, and then I'm going to run it. Right, let's ask it some questions. The first question I'm gonna uh, ask it is, summarize the results of the third quarter yes. LMG. Okay. So it's going to go into that uh, PDF of the PowerPoint that I uh, uploaded and then it's going to uh, summarize I go through all the all the slides and summarize uh, the information so it's it's going to go through that now. All right, so had a strong cash position of 429 million. So I'll just verify that. So cash position 24.9 million or 
429 million. It says that the balance sheet looked healthy uh, with a book equity ratio of 32%. So I'll search for book equity. Right, so it's got that information correct. What else does it say? Um, and then there's no debt maturities uh, occurring before 2028, which is correct. And then um, it has quite a lot of uh, additional useful information here. So let me ask it more questions here. Um, specifically, what is the uh, debt situation? So let's drill down on that. All right, so uh, it's characterized by significant deleverage effort. And indeed, that's true. They don't have uh, debt maturities prior to 2028. So I'll just put foundation here. Yeah. All right, so that's correct. And then the total debt repaid was uh, faster. And they have a $400 million revolving credit facility. So it's been able to uh, dive into this presentation, which is 27, 23 pages long and uh, summarize uh, quite, quite well. And now let's just do one last one here, uh, just to talk about the macro conditions. All right, so it talks about LNG demand, uh, Europe, Europe LNG in, imports, LNG prices, spot market. This is uh, actually all, all very insightful and uh, uh, quite accurate according to my understanding of uh, this company as well. So uh, pretty good, you know, pre pretty good and, and uh, impressive. Uh, and, and as you can see, quite easy to build uh, these custom AI that has the custom knowledge base and, and able to leverage that quite well.